You're watching UNICEF Television. Children with disabilities are among the most vulnerable and excluded in the world. Their rights are often violated. Hidden at home or placed in special institutions, a child with disabilities often misses out on education. They grow up apart from their families. Parents fear their children with disabilities will be mocked and won't have a chance to take part in society. The World Report on Disabilities estimates that one in 10 children under the age of 15 lives with disabilities, meaning they are not unusual. Despite the challenges, many countries in Central and Eastern Europe and in Central Asia are making positive changes in their lives. Alex is jedan zadovoljan i srećan dečak koji živi u jednoj zdravoj sredini sa drugarima od kojih je prihvaćen i nastavnicima koji mu izlaze u susret kad god je potrebno. UNICEF is working with governments to support education systems, families and children to reduce inequities created by social exclusion. When as many children as possible have access to quality education, it's good for the society as such, because then you enrich the whole society also at the same time. Armenia, Montenegro and Serbia recently demonstrated to UNICEF's executive board the progress they've made. That includes changing policies to ensure that children with disabilities are provided with quality, inclusive education. That means giving each and every child an opportunity to learn at their local school with enough support to reach their full potential. Sa zakonskim okvirom mi smo stvorili mogućnosti za lakši upis dece u osnovne škole i mogućnost da se za svako dete sa posebnim potrebama ili invaliditetom da se napravi poseban obrazovni plan. Inclusive education does not require special schools, care, expensive materials, or specialized expertise. It simply means all students, including children with disabilities, should have the opportunity to receive individualized services and approaches to learning. Povećanjem svijesti ljudi da je zaista obrazovanje djece sa posebnim potrebama ključ uspjeha njihove daljeg razvoja. As a result of these efforts, more schools in Serbia are now welcoming children with disabilities. In Montenegro, there's been increased public demand for inclusive schools thanks to awareness campaigns, in Armenia, through strong support from civil society. Just imagine a world where all children are included, involved, where their talents are celebrated, where their contributions are recognized. That is the world towards which UNICEF is working. Children with disabilities are now starting to attend local schools, make friends, and grow up to be active members of their own communities. This is MP Noonan reporting for UNICEF Television. For more information, go to unicef.org. You've been watching UNICEF Television.